brought the team to Flight Room in the Green Lake neighborhood. The first rule of the Flight Room is you do not talk about the Flight Room. So it's a mix of yoga and aerial work. And I'm not good at yoga or aerial work, so this should go well. And so if someone, let's say, has struggled with yoga on the ground, could this be a good option for them to try? Absolutely, because you have the hammock there for that support. Alexandra is our teacher, and she is just great. So the silk itself will hold up to about, I think it's 1,800 pounds. Mm. The ties... That should cover you, Jim. I'm not just going to throw you in. We're going to ease into this like an old man easing into a warm bath. Yeah? There you go. Uh, on your knees. Oh. You know, we haven't even really started yet. Whew. So far, so good. Alexandra got us started off by doing warm-ups, and here's where I begin to pretend that I'm struggling. Ah. <laughs> So not long after we got here, Alexandra showed us how it should be done. What? Oh, yeah. Easy breezy. We got this. All right, I've memorized it up to this point, but now I'm getting lost. <laughs> and then we tried. So you're going to take it all the way back, and you're going to take your right leg up. And you're going to go, ah! I don't think that's right. Nope. Yes. Now, how do I get out of this? <laughs> that was embarrassing. Bend both knees. Bring your knee to your chest. Give it a kiss. Thanks. And then send it away like an old lover. Oh, Jim, careful. So Angela brings a real positive, like, cheerleader energy. Kim is intuitive and graceful. And Saint is also here today. All right, are you guys ready to go upside down? Silk to sacrum. Head goes heavy, legs go wide. I had to do this in every Spider-Man movie I acted in, so I know exactly what this requires. God. Well. Whoa. Let go with your hands. No, I don't want to do that. Well, I didn't want to pay my taxes, but I did. <laughs> the scariest part is just letting go and recognizing that you're not going to fall and you know what you're doing. Did I just say a life metaphor? <laughs> One hand, one hand, then the other. Oh my God, look. Yeah, no problem. Wait, nope, nope, nope. Oh, yeah, you can fall. <laughs> but your instructor will catch you. Ugh. I would agree the hardest part was definitely letting go. You're right there, you're right so there. So close. My hands are sore from holding on for dear life. You got there all by yourself. It was the instructor who pointed out, Angela, you were only one of two people who actually finished the actual maneuver. Just saying. I was the other one. <laughs> he did it! Jim did it. I didn't realize that I was as graceful as I am until I got into the flight room and took flight. Honestly, in the end, it was such a good time. We got to reward ourselves with what a hammock is usually used for. You know, yoga really is relaxing.